Alright guys, what's up? So today we're going to be talking about the suite made by the Roblox RTC Twitter account. And basically, uh, Roblox is planning to add a new update for stuff regarding to hackers. So basically, these updates are the anti-cheat update and the alt account detection update. So the anti-cheat update is basically just um, an improved, I guess, client for anti-cheat in Roblox games. So um, Roblox games will have a better time detecting when there's a hacker in the server because Roblox's anti-cheat system is pretty terrible. Uh, I'm pretty sure nobody gets banned from using anti-cheat or I mean gets banned from cheating on Roblox. People get away with it quite often and I'm very glad that they're looking into this because you know, the hackers have really been rising to Roblox more often, and I see them a lot in Roblox Bed Wars and other games. Um, I don't really play too much Roblox games anymore, but when I do, I'm playing Bed Wars, and there's usually a lot of hackers in Bed Wars, and it's kind of infuriating to play when there's a hacker on the enemy team, and they just instantly mine your bed and kill you without even having a battle. You know, that sucks a lot. So, seeing this update finally take place soon is very like exciting so the anti-cheat update is coming around mid 2023 so um, maybe in a couple of months we'll see this and the alt account detection update is coming late 2023 so that's gonna be around maybe the end of 2023 somewhere around there but honestly I'm very excited for these updates because you know it kind of does ruin my mood. I'm not gonna lie; these hackers do ruin my mood, though. Like when I'm trying to play Roblox games and they just come into the server and start making me lose. Like I just don't vibe with that at all. And just seeing Roblox take action on important stuff is pretty cool because they don't really do that that often, you know. They always change up the website sometimes. Like for example, they changed up the word catalog to marketplace for some reason. Like that's one of their updates, and they're not really taking. Um, important updates into consideration when it comes to updating the website so that's why I just like seeing Roblox make new stuff that's actually very useful and let me talk about some more things regarding this update so this person said I'm about to get more alts than ever which is this is a joke guys it's all good but anyway they said that they're gonna get more alts than ever and then Roblox RTC replied saying that repeated offenders most likely means that they will be getting IP banned off the platform and possibly getting sent a cease and desist letter to your house. And uh, yeah, that's honestly quite scary. If you're hacking on Roblox, you really should not be hacking to the point where you're getting a cease and desist letter from Roblox, okay? Um... I don't think Roblox sends a cease and desist letter that much to people in general. Like, the only people I know of that have gotten a cease and desist letter is Ruben Sim and the, um, the Crosswood hackers. And that's pretty much it. I don't know anyone else that has gotten a cease and desist letter from this. So, if you're getting a cease and desist letter from Roblox, you better stop because they're going to beat you in a lawsuit, bro. Because Roblox is a rich company, they can definitely get some good lawyers on their side. So, make sure you don't get in legal trouble with Roblox, okay? That's not good. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to really say regarding this update. Let me know what you guys think of this update. And let me know if you guys experience a lot of hackers in Roblox games. Because um, I really just play Bed Wars nowadays. I don't play anything else, really. So... I definitely experience a lot of hackers in this game because people just like to cheat in this game for some reason. But yeah, uh, let me know your guys' experiences with this. And um, yeah, that's all. So thank you guys for watching. Subscribe for new. And goodbye.